Let's make these delicious pastries with some leftover queen's butter. Let me just admit that I made way too much of that butter and now I'm just trying to find creative ways to use it up. So today's experiment is going to use apples and puff pastry to hopefully make some good pastries. I'm very fortunate for the luxury of being able to wing it with my food, but let me tell you what Palestinians have had to resort to. For multiple months, Israel has been withholding aid to Gaza, meaning they have weaponized mass starvation. About 90% of children, pregnant, and breastfeeding women face severe poverty. People are so hungry they're starting to eat animal feed. Innocent civilians are surviving the attacks, getting bandaged up, sent away only to pass away a few days later from starvation. A two-month-old baby just passed away because his mother could not find enough food to produce the nutrients the baby needed to survive. Stories like this will continue as long as Israel is withholding the aid against the ICJ's orders. Getting back to the pastries, they're fully cooked and they tasted amazing. I have the cinnamony floral apple taste and I can't wait to find another creative way to use the queen's butter.